properties of addition. Do you know the properties of addition? Rules guide us to do things right. There are also rules that we need to remember to do our addition correct and fast. These are the properties of addition. Order property or commutative property. Grouping property or associative property. Zero property or identity property. The order property or commutative property shows that changing the order of the addends does not change the sum. Study the example below. 3 and 2 is the same as 2 and 3. So 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 is the same as 2 plus 3 is equal to 5. The grouping property or associative property shows that changing the grouping of the addends does not change the sum. So 1 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 5 is the same as 1 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 5. We use open and close parentheses in grouping the addends. The zero property or identity property shows that adding a number to zero or adding zero to a number does not change the number. Study the example below. So 3 plus 0 is equal to 3 is the same as 0 plus 3 is equal to 3. Is 7 plus 2 the same as 2 plus 7? Now, let's try to explore. Write the addition sentence. Zero plus three is equal to three is the same as three plus zero is equal to. Three. Two plus three plus one is equal to six is the same as 
2 plus 3 plus 1 is equal to 6. Three plus four plus two is equal to nine. Is the same as three plus four plus two is equal to nine. Three plus two is equal to five. Is the same as 2 plus 3 is equal to 5. 3 plus 4 is the same as 4 plus 3 is equal to 7. Add the first two addends. Add the sum to the third number to get the answer. Number one. The first two addends are five and four. So we add five plus four is equal to nine. The third number is one. So nine plus one is equal to 10. Number 2. The first two addends are 8 and 3. So we add 8 plus 3 is equal to 11. The third number is 4. So we add 11 plus 4 is equal to 15. Number 3. The first two addends are 3 and 6. So we add 3 plus 6 is equal to 9. The third number is 5. So 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. Number 4. The first two addends are 7 and 1. So we add 7 plus 1 is equal to 8. The third number is 4. So 8 plus 4 is equal to 12. Number 5. The first two addends are 6 and 2. So we add 6 plus 2 is equal to 9. The third number is 9. So 9 plus 9 is equal to 18. Remember, when we add, the order of the addends may be changed. But the sum stays the same. The groupings of the addends may be changed, but the sum stays the same. If zero is added to a number or a number is added to zero, the sum is equal to the number. Thank you for listening. You may now proceed. To your next task. Goodbye.